everyone. Welcome back to the Easy Maths channel. Let's learn about the law of sines. We first need to take a triangle. Let the angles of that triangle be A, B, C. The side opposite to angle B is called B. The side opposite to angle A is called A. And the side opposite to angle C is called C. Accordingly, the principle of law of sines. Sine A by A equals sine B by B equals sine C by C. The given values are angle B equals 36 degrees, angle C equals 113 degrees, angle A is unknown. And side B equals 15, side A is unknown, and side C is also unknown. How do we find the missing angle? First, we have to find the angle A. For that, we know that the sum of all angles in a triangle is 180 degrees. So from 180, we subtract 36 and 113. This gives us 31. Let's assume that is A. Place the value of angle A in the triangle next. Find the missing side as per the law. Let's take sine A by A equals sine B by B. 31 degrees in sine A, 36 degrees in sine B, and 15 in B have to be substituted. Cross multiply these two terms, giving you 15 sine 31 degrees equals, and cross multiply these two terms, A sine 36 degrees. We know that the value of sine 31 degrees is approx 0 0.515. And we know that the value of sine 36 degrees is approx 0 0.587. That's 15 times 0 0.515 equals A times 0 0.587. That's 7.725 equals A times 0. 0.587. Now, since we want A by itself, bring the rest of the values to the other side, which will reverse the multiplication. A equals 7.725 by 0 0.587, and that will give you an answer of A equals 13.16. Now for the other side, as per the law, Let's take sine A by A equals sine C by C. A is 31 degrees. The other A is 13.16. Now cross multiply. C sine 31 degrees equals 13.16 sine 113. We know that the value of sine 31 degrees is approx 0.5150. That gives C times 0 0.5150 equals 12.11. C equals 12.11 by 0 0.5150. C equals 23.509. And that's our missing side. If you found this video to be helpful, make sure to like and subscribe for more.